Hey guys, it's me Keisha and I'm back with a, another video and yeah, I really need to work on this intro. I feel like ever since I've rebranded my channel and changed the name and stuff, like, I don't know, I feel like I'm struggling with an intro. So if you guys have any ideas of what my intro could be, I would love, love, love for you to help me. So please comment below. But yeah, so I post new videos twice a week, Wednesdays and Fridays, and I predominantly talk about magic and witchcraft and any sort of bits in between. So yeah, let's get started. So this one I'm quite excited about is I am going to be creating a vision board. I haven't done one for a while. A pretty, vision board's pretty much a buzzword, so I'm pretty sure that you'd know what a vision board is but if you don't a vision board is where you use paper cards um you could do one digitally on phones apps or pinterest or whatever where you um use images and uh, words and things like that that you want to manifest into your life so you collate them onto how whatever medium you're using and just sort of keep it somewhere that you can see and stuff and it just helps to sort of focus your intent and put out in the universe what it is that you want to manifest in your life and yeah so i'm so this video i'm just going to be showing you what bits i'm going to be using my vision board and then i thought that would be cool that if you if you want to make a vision board with me that you get all your bits together and then the next video that will follow on for this one will be me crafting my vision board and so and then you can have a we can make them together so i thought that'd be really cool so i'll just show you what i've got so i went to hobbycraft and bought a few things so uh for those of you in america you or other places you could go to like hobby lobby um any sort of craft store or like dollar tree dollar general family dollar um go to michael's would be a really good one like joann's get some bits just like target walmart or supermarkets um anywhere really just to get bits you probably have some stuff that you can use at home too but you'll need if you're doing a physical vision board that's not like on an app you'll need some scissors some pens that i didn't pick up for this video but you get the drift some i got craft glue that was just for now it was like 80p or whatever but yeah some sort of crafting glue or um print stick or any sort of bits to stick stuff down i'm also using some uh washi tape i bought this one from hobbycraft it's like 50p or something it says wonderlust and it's like in purple it's really pretty and i got this gold one as well that's you can't see it. it's friggin friggin dark but um this one says big plants so i'm gonna use that with a combination of glue and stuff as well i also got a few sticker books they were only a pound each so this one is shoot for the stars um it's just got a few different sheets of stickers so uh, oh, you can't see it it's light there we go so it's just this one's like got crystals and uh, moons and stars and there's like shoot for the stars um there's like planets and all different sort of things like that and i really liked the colors it's sort of like purples and blues and pinks so yeah so i got that one this one is a let the journey begin which i really love you can't see you can't see but yeah so this one has got like let's explore there's like uh, I love camping, there's little bees and flowers and little toadstools, little tents, uh, little camper vans, little trees, little barbecues, um, yeah, it's just a really cute, it's an adventure, go outdoors, let's explore, it's just really cute, and then the other one that I bought was, oh, I showed you Shoot for the Stars, didn't I, the other one that I got was Botanical Beauty, and that one's this one's really pretty it's just got loads of like holographic sort of different butterflies 
and flowers and uh, birds and ladybugs. So yeah, it was just really, really pretty. So I thought they were really good for a pound each. And then final thing that I bought was a uh, Project Life um, kit. This one, I believe, well, actually I didn't end up getting it from Hobbycraft because I've seen this for like a year and I've always wanted to get it. It's quite expensive. It's like £15. But I was just like biding my time and then I was like, right, I'm going to be doing my vision board. This would be handy for bits on my vision board and for sticking my planners and journaling and stuff so i thought i'm gonna get it went into hobbycraft and i couldn't find it anywhere i couldn't find it on their website or anything like that so i think it must be discontinued i found this on amazon this is the bohemian adventure one um so i met it was like for a third party seller so i managed to get it so i was really chuffed um they only had one left so i think this one might be discontinued but yeah if you search like on ebay and stuff i'm sure that you'll find it it's um project life by becky higgins it's 130 pieces in there and there's it's um there's this different journaling cards and embellishments and it's just really it's hard for you to see but it's just really really pretty i just love the aesthetic of it so um there's like moons um as cards are like wild and free this is the good life uh today was a great day different embellishments sort of like mandalas and like dream catchers and feathers and it's got like a um native american vibe boho vibe which i absolutely love so there's uh 60 journaling cards and 70 embellishments so it's really pretty so i'm going to be using that as well and also um just have a folder and make today count um that this just this just has different um like magazines that i read like one of like you've seen my favorite magazines i'll talk about before like spirit and destiny and i like soul and spirit any magazines really like her magazine whatever you read or whatever you can get your hands on i've just sort of cut out um different sort of uh, images and things like that but yes yeah, so I apply so get some magazines as well and um, you can also go on the internet which I've done as well for my vision board so that is my logo that I created for my brand and um, I went on the internet and printed off um, different uh, quotes and uh, things that I want to manifest in my life and yeah so I've done printed that off as well that I'm going to be using and yeah so basically any anything you want to use really so just like uh, stickers um, images off the internet uh, magazines you can cut out like the lettering and stuff that you like you can write stuff uh, you could use different types of card and things like that to show you i forgot why did i forget oh but it's a flag i got these from hobbycraft as well the card i'm going to be using you probably if this is sort of like an iridescent like a lilac color and that one i really loved as well is like a green and that same sort of iridescent so i'm thinking of possibly so i, th I would if you're going to do a vision board i probably say a3 size which is what this is so that's the next step up for an a4 I'd probably say is better for vision boards i feel like a4 size paper is too small really to create a vision board i feel like if you have something a bit bigger you've got a bit more space so i was thinking because i grabbed the purple first and then i saw the green as well i mean these were only like one pound something each so i was thinking maybe of doing it uh double-sided possibly but then i was like but if i have a double-sided vision board like i can only um start at one side but then i don't know it depends how big i'm how much stuff i'm going to include on it i'm not too sure but so i don't know whether i'll have a double-sided one or whether i'll just have it stick it double-sided so it's a bit more thicker and room um, like reinforced or whether i'll just use cut these out use these as backgrounds to stick on there i'm not really too sure but yeah, so those are the sort of supplies and things that you need. So get your supplies and we will do this together in my next video. So until next time, stay dreaming and keep enchanted.